एंड यहाँ पर ये गीत को हम सुनवाएंगे ज़रूर सुनवाएंगे सर आपको मगर ये कि हम कोशिश कर रहे थे कि हमारी लाइन जो है वो ज़्याद फ़ाऊद जो आपका अल्लाह भला करे सीनियर स्पोर्ट्स जर्नलिस्ट हैं अल बयान न्यूज़पेपर यूएई के और इस वक्त सब फीफा का वर्ल्ड कप 2022 कतर में हो रहा है तो उस वक्त वो देख के भी आ रहे हैं मेरा ख्याल बताएंगे लेटेस्ट क्या हो रहा है वहाँ पर ज़्यादा अस्सलाम वालेकुम वरह लाही वरक हवाड़िया Okay. Oh, okay. 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 Habibi. Okay. So with me is uh, my uh, very senior uh, partner, Mr. Majid Jamal. So we are going to check with you what's going on in uh, Qatar, especially uh, this new upset that we have seen. Saudi Arabia bashed Argentina. So how is the sentiment in the Arab world? <laughs> Uh, first of all, uh, hi to Mr. Jamal. How are you? Waalaikum <laughs> <laughs> salam wa rahmatullah. See, uh, if, you can, if you can see me, I'm I'm wearing red right now to support my Canada. Uh, it's, uh, okay, so I have to uh, wearing green uh, because I'm supporting Saudi Arabia. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't have I don't have anything green. <laughs> hey, would that wouldn't that be nice if Saudi and uh, uh, Canada plays against each other? We we'll be you know what? Then we you and I will be doing a live commentary for that. Sure, sure, and I will be celebrate winning uh, with Saudi. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, Ziad, what what do you uh, how do you feel what's happening with the world cup right now there okay so uh, uh, i feel surprised in the beginning because uh, football is not uh, uh, there is nothing uh, you can say you, you can judge football you cannot judge football you cannot uh, expect what uh, what is happening nobody can expect that uh, saudi arabia can uh, win over uh, argentina over messi and uh, the the huge names that are playing in argentina de maria whatever so uh, but this is football this is football it's it's not about expectations it's not about uh, the rules uh, every time it's uh, the football is uh, surprising us and it was a very good surprise actually So you you, you uh, of course you liked it right uh, what about germany and japan that that's a surprise too uh, i i i will not lie it was not a surprise to me <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, i will tell you i will tell you uh, uh, i i have i have evidence that it's not surprise uh, uh, i was in uh, a podcast in alpayan today uh, before the match Okay. Okay. So uh, I think. So you I, went to. So you went to Albayan, and then what happened? And hear me? Yeah, yeah, we can hear you. Uh, just a second. Now? Yeah, 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 yeah. Go, yeah. Ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Hello. Hi. Yes, yes, yes please. Uh, so uh, I have my evidence that uh, I was not surprised uh, uh, with the result of Japan and Germany. Today I was uh, like interview in uh, or a podcast in Al Bayan uh, before the match, and I said that uh, Japan it's a very difficult game to Germany, especially in in nowadays because uh, the German team is not uh, the surprising team or the the wonderful team that we know before. Still, it's a very big name, and still we respect uh, the German team. It's Uh, amazing team but it's not that powerful uh, like before so mm-hmm. i expect and uh, somehow that it will happen that uh, it will be a difficult match uh, for sure i didn't <laughs> expect that uh, japan will win mm-hmm. but uh, i expect it will be a difficult team for germany mm-hmm. 
Okay, all right. So, are you going to Qatar now finally to watch the at least the finals? I wish I wish I can do, but uh, it's uh, to wa to work inside the the newspaper itself. You know, it's uh, the you have to have somebody outside and uh, somebody inside to uh, rewrite what is uh, published. Mm -hmm. So I, I wish that I can go. Ziad, uh, 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 are you? Good. Are you are you are you following Canadian team uh, in any way? Uh, do you know about Canadian team? Uh, I, I I I would be lying if I said that uh, I was following the Canadian team. Uh, it's uh, I know that it's uh, a, a good team, not a wonderful team. It's uh, <laughs> they follow a few. Yeah, uh, yeah. We can say, well, the uh, first time, first they, time in thirty, they, first time in thirty six years uh, we qualified. So this is uh, and they are all very young except for one person. They are all very young kids yeah. there. Uh, yes, uh, and and uh, uh, I wish I wish that uh, they are not uh, they, uh, the atmosphere will not uh, make them fear, because fear is against uh, the the winning. Hmm. You have you have to have the courage uh, to win, hmm. uh, and and trust trust to trust yourself. Uh, it's it's always we are saying to everybody: if you trust yourself, you can uh, gain a lot. If you didn't trust yourself, you will lose. Hmm. So the the Canadian team, uh, he, they are youth, smart, young guys. Uh, they have to trust themselves that they can win, hmm. and they can do everything if they trust themselves. Hmm. See, the okay. thing is that Belgium is uh, supposed to be number two ranking in the world right now, and uh, the game is going on right now. As I speak to you, I'm watching the game. Uh, Belgium is leading Canada one nothing, but majority of the game and possession is with Canada. Canada is giving them a very tough time. Uh, unfortunate that Canada missed their penalty kick in the first three minutes. Uh, and uh, uh, This will affect this. I hope that it's not affecting, but it, uh, some, sometimes when you are young, uh, a little bit of details uh, will affect your performance. So uh, losing uh, or, or uh, wasting uh, penalty kick is uh, somehow tough to the young guys. Uh, I can say that uh, Belgium team is not that horrible team, or uh, you can uh, fear of uh, Belgium. I think there is a big gap between the Egyptian national team and uh, Belgium, and the Egyptian national team win win the game against uh, Belgium. Yeah. Uh, Belgium. Mm. So uh, it, it's a matter. It's a matter of knowing uh, how how to beat your. Uh, I I don't want to say it as enemy, but how to beat the other team. Hmm. It's uh, the 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 Canadian team have to study, hmm. uh, even in uh, between the the two halves, he have to study what is the what's wrong with the Belgium team. They have a lot of uh, problems. They they are uh, uh, they are not that fast in the back. In the defense, mm. uh, so mm. I, I think I think they have to play in a fast fast game against them and the uh, and uh, after the middle field. Mm -hmm. Okay, they right. don't have to make a they don't have mm. to make a back defense. Okay, let against, me let uh, me let me put you let me uh, uh, Ziad, let me put you on the spot. Who do you think uh, is going to end up coming to the finals? <laughs> Ah, uh, this is. Uh, I, I'm not that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this is, there, there is going to be surprise, right? There is going to be this year. I I feel there is going to be surprises. You know, you know, it's very difficult uh, World Cup. It's but not you are the like expert. Usual, uh, See, you are, but you are. <laughs> I take usual. you. I take you as an expert. Uh, Ziad, come on. I take you as an expert. So you you got to tell me. Okay, final two teams. I, 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 you know, you know the the octopus, uh, the bull octopus, yeah. the one who makes yeah. uh, the. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm trying to wear my octopus jacket and uh, <laughs> saying that I think Brazil, <laughs> Brazil and Argentina will go to the. I final. thought you're gonna say Ca Canada and <laughs> Saudi Arabia. <laughs> no, no, there, is a, there is a lot. Of, there is a, a big gap or a big difference between wishing and uh, <laughs> expecting. Hmm. I'm expecting uh, from my ex uh, expert, but uh, wishing, yes, I, I need, I, I wish that the uh, Morocco team will uh, go to the final. I wish the Saudi Arabia will go to the final. No, you can't uh, say, you can't pick Morocco because Morocco is in, <laughs> uh, in, in uh, Canadian 
group is it, are, aren't they in group f <laughs> yes how could okay. you <laughs> canadian team will not be in the final <laughs> 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 okay okay see so my question is there has been a lot of negative press by the west about qatar so what do you have to say about that i have to say that uh, we, uh, there is a still uh, um, I, i don't uh, i don't want to speak about political uh, too much but uh, europe europe is seeing everybody else is uh, a second grade than them so mm. the main concept is that uh, they can see that uh, who's qatar to organize the world cup mm. and this is a big problem mm. i can say i can say that uh, uh, i'm sorry for my words i can uh, i can uh, 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 sit in my uh, in my home with my boxer, but I cannot uh, live in your home with uh, a boxer. Hmm. So this is the difference. Every every country have its rules, and we have to respect. I'm um, I'm Egyptian. We have a lot of rules, uh, but I'm living here in UAE, so I have to uh, commit to the 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 UAE rules hmm. because I'm living inside. and uh, that's what i can i can say about uh, a lot of problems that uh, and uh, in english newspaper uh, from great britain newspaper they are always attacking qatar and attacking the freedom and attacking a lot of things that uh, it's against our culture and against mm. our uh, community mm. and against the rules inside the country you are uh, any 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 guest is welcomed in in, in our countries mm. we are all welcome everybody but uh, with our rules mm. Mm. okay yeah uh, like for example there was a lot of uh, uh, you know discussion on uh, you know gay rights and human rights and uh, people cannot drink in qatar so that was creating a lot of problems but uh, uh, especially also they wanted to wear that uh, you know uh, a ribbon for lgbt so all those things but qatar made it very clear and even the president fifa president made it clear uh, you journalists who are going from al bayan for example to cover this uh, definitely you are all arabs uh, according to the arab perspective what do you have to say about all these things i have to say a lot of things but uh, you don't want uh, to look it's <laughs> 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 very sensitive uh, yeah, things yeah, yeah. i can understand And, that uh, we we respect, we respect we respect all freedoms hmm. but it's uh, just when you are at my home hmm. just respect my uh, rules hmm. because uh, uh, don't put your freedom against my rules or hmm. against uh, my culture hmm. that's that's what we can say but hmm. uh, we can respect everybody we well, if you want to drink uh, just go and drink but don't drink in my home hmm. that's the problem hmm. drink anybody ever, hmm. anywhere hmm. but uh, i am i am in my home uh, i prefer everybody come inside my uh, my home i have to uh, take off his shoes hmm. so hmm. Uh, it's not it's not a freedom to come with your dirty shoes uh, inside my home this hmm. is not a dirt uh, this is freedom yeah you know and and be always like this respect i will respect your freedom but also respect my rules Mm. respect my culture respect for uh, and my beliefs mm. so mm. that's what i can say mm. okay your your uh, your your reporters who are because you are a senior editor your reporters who are in qatar what do they tell you what is the general sentiment there in doha Uh, 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 uh look at uh, the arrangements what the arrangements that qatar has made and how happy people are or, or how, wh- what is going on there a lot of people a lot of people I, i'm just uh, i'm not trying to make a propaganda but uh, uh, in the world cup uh, it's uh, it's always joy hmm. it's always happiness everywhere a lot of celebration everywhere hmm. and uh, in in qatar it's not that big so it's Uh, it's very good that you can see a lot of matches in the same days uh, not like uh, russia not like uh, brazil which is a, a very big uh, countries mm. so you can't go from stadium to another but in qatar it's uh, limited and there is a lot of celebrations everywhere 
uh, I think it's uh, it's it's joy everywhere. Everybody is celebrating with the World Cup, wh whatever or or wherever the place that uh, held the end. Uh, so uh, this is football. Football, it's not about the place. It's about the globalization. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> uh, we have heard that a lot of tourists have come and st they are staying in Dubai. So do you know somebody who has come from Egypt or other places who are staying in Dubai and just going for one or two matches or maybe they will go for the finals to Qatar to watch? Have you heard something like that? I, I, I know I know a lot of uh, Moroccans and uh, Tunisian uh, and e even Egyptian. Who, who came here in uh, Dubai and uh, went to uh, just to, to watch the match and re then return back. Hmm. It's happening. It's happening everywhere. Uh, um, I have a, a colleague, even a journalist. He's uh, staying here in Dubai. He's an Egyptian guy. Hmm. He's staying in Dubai and just to go to the match and come back to Dubai. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it means that there and are a lot of tourists in Dubai as well now. Spanish? Yes, yes, for sure, for sure. A lot of tourists uh, uh, prefer, uh, or uh, not prefer, it's very easy for them and uh, maybe cheaper uh, to stay in Dubai than uh, reserving in the Qatar, especially the guys who who's not reserving from the beginning. The, you know, the, the, the people who take the decision late, hmm. there, is not a, uh, there is not a lot of places, hmm. so it's better for them uh, to be in Dubai, mm -hmm. and it's very near. Okay, all right. Anything else you want to ask, Majisab? Uh, no, 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 no. It was <laughs> wonderful talking to you, Ziad. Uh, and uh, I'll take up on, on your final two. So uh, let's see if you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if, if you're correct on your final two. Uh, but uh, <laughs> the bottom line is that we are having a great time watching uh, uh, the, the way the arrangements are. Uh, see, I live uh, uh, in North America, and uh, but I can still tell you that it uh, doesn't matter how much we try, we cannot compare the, 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 uh, all the things that Qatar has done. It is amazing. Uh, to create uh, eight eight uh, stadiums, and uh, on top of that, all the other arrangements they have made, it is doesn't matter West or doesn't matter North America can complain whatever complain they want to do. But the bottom line is that they can never ever. I've seen many uh, other uh, FIFA uh, championships, but the only thing is that nothing compared to what Qatar have done. Yes, that's right. Uh, totally agree. Totally agreed. Even I mean, if you are I'm Egyptian? <laughs> even, 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 I, I wish that the uh, Egypt national team playing in the World Cup. But, uh, yeah, I know. Okay. We, we, we miss Mohammed Salah. <laughs> yes, for sure, for sure. Everybody is missing him. And, uh, but really, really, I'm very proud what, uh, uh, about what happens in uh, Qatar. Hmm. Uh, we are all proud. Uh, really, we are all very proud. We, we, Yes, they they did a very very uh, very good job. But we cannot describe our uh, our joy and our. It's uh, never happened uh, before, and it will never happen. Admire for what happens. It's it's a great. It's a great, and uh, you know, small countries and uh, huge abilities. Hmm. This is what. Uh, Ziad, what I, uh, I can I can tell you very confidently that it never happened like this ever in FIFA hmm. and uh, it will never happen again. Next time in 2026 is happening in Canada, uh, America and Mexico. But uh, uh, even three power countries, they cannot even match what uh, Qatar has done and uh, they, they have uh, nothing but uh, deserve congratulations for whatever they have done so far. Yes. Sure, and, and please, please let uh, the World Cup be in Egypt once. <laughs> <laughs> we will do that. And uh, we will also connect with you um, uh, during finals or semi-finals, uh, Ziad. Thank you very much for your comments. If you are kind enough and if you awesome. can connect Thank with you. us again, we will be very happy. Sure, sure. You are welcome anytime. Appreciate okay. it. You have a wonderful day, Ziad. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I know it's very late in Dubai, but I know you are Egyptian. You are uh, you stay awake late. <laughs> this is our life. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ziyad, thank thank you. you so much. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.